This is like the greatest subject in the world. I think it was Spurgeon that coined the phrase of the irresistible grace of God. There's something about that grace that emanates from his goodness that's irresistible to anyone who sees it for what it is. And for you and me, it's, it's not supposed to be just a point of theology on a list of things we believe. It's actually an invitation to encounter God at a level that changes and transforms us. It makes us a contagious people in that realm called the goodness of God. If you'll taste and experience for yourself God's goodness, it will shift how you look at life and how you see the world around you. It changes everything. Once a person sees the heart of God, the nature of God, the passion of God, you can no longer stay the way we've been. And, um, and what, this, what the scripture compels us to do and invites us into is to live in an experience of God's goodness to where you and I actually become contagious. One of the things that, um, that I've taught on a, a lot in times past is, is the nature of this world versus heaven. The, this world is filled with unbelief. It's filled with hostility. It's filled with skepticism, those kinds of things. God's world, heaven, is filled with absolute trust, perfect peace, faith, all those things. 